I want to show you how we used a very simple and clear tactic in the Amazon's API keyword tracker to get a bestseller badge for a client. I'm Lucas Kwiatkowski, founder of Nomads, hands-on and advanced PPC. And first off, I want to say, you know, all these videos are my face and it, you know, it's me talking about this, but I want to be clear that I am getting a lot of these ideas and case studies at this point from my team. They're the ones who have been doing this. Um, they are seeing these great results for our clients. So this specifically shout out to Phil. Phil is the one who got these results for this client and I couldn't be here without my team. So I want to make sure that I'm giving them the, the knowledge they deserve. Okay. Now, the biggest thing here that we're kind of laughing about that we see the best results with clients is when they work with us. I know that seems very simple, but constant communication and common goals are what make our job easier and results way better. So what pains us is when we have clients who don't respond to us, don't give us feedback, don't tell us their goals because that makes our job very hard. So this client was very in the weeds with us, right? Uh, he was working with the strategies and helping us out. And that's why we saw some of the best results. And the clients we've had for years and years are the ones who work with us. Now, into the PPC. What we did here was a two-pronged approach. So we not only increased spend and hit the top keywords, but we dropped price and did promos. So we ran this before the holidays and we said, hey, this is a this is a summer product. So historically, this is not a Q4 brand, but we said during the holidays, we want to hit our main keywords and see what we can do. So we dropped price and we aggressively went after, I think, 30 to 40 main keywords. And I'm going to show you the data in a second. We got new creatives. So the client got new uh, videos and images made for Christmas specific content that we could use in sponsored brand and sponsored brand video. And then we use the Amazon's API. So I'm going to show you that in a second and show you how we were tracking keywords time over time along with our PPC strategy to see how they were in gaining rank. Now let me dive into the data. So I want to show you that historically, these are the December figures this brand was hitting. It was 100, maybe 200K, maybe 250. It would reach there. Now, this December compared to last December, we're at 450, 140% increase. All by working together and again, hitting those main keywords. And I want to show you um, another something interesting. Is week over week sales actually started the week before Cyber Monday. So Cyber Monday is this week, right? Because uh, November or Thanksgiving was the 25th. So before that, we were already ramping up. And that's the key is to get ahead of the game, drop the price, spend a lot of money on those high volume keywords, and eventually it's going to pay off. Now, let me jump into the Amazon API and show you how we're tracking this time over time. And then I can um, dive into this a little deeper. So I had this pulled up here and I know a lot is gonna be blurred out, but this is what we're looking at. So this is going to get updated daily, okay? This keyword rank, and we can see day over day how we're ranking for keywords. This is all for our uh, by ASIN, right? So this is for our best-selling ASIN, and we have about 40 keywords. So if we look back on November 10th, these keywords had no rank at all. We weren't ranking on them, okay? But we got this list of keywords with the client and we said, hey, we're, these are the ones we're gonna hit. So if I look at the average keyword rank on November 10th, it was 17. Across the board, across these 40 keywords, we're ranking 17. This one at the top is, is, the, is the highest volume keyword, obviously, right? So keep an eye on this one. On November 20th, when we started to see that sales spike, this highest volume keyword, all of a sudden we're ranking on it, okay? Because we're using exact match, we were hitting it hard, and we knew what we were going after. Week over week, got a little better, got a little better. All of a sudden, Cyber Monday hits, we're ranking number four on this keyword. This is when we got the best seller badge. So now we get the best seller badge on this date after hitting it hard for a week. 
this week beforehand is what makes this strategy work. Getting conversions before the traffic is there. So if you remember on November 10th, our average was uh, 17 BSR. Now look at this. All of these keywords have ranks. And these ones we didn't have before, we're ranked number two for now. Our average BSR now is eight. We went from an average of 17 to eight. We cut our, our keyword rank in half across the board for all of these keywords. We now have the best seller badge. Tacos is dropping because we have a little bit of Christmas traffic left. And we're organically ranked at the top of the page for all of these keywords. Okay, so mantra is to get out of this video. Keep your keyword list short, keep it simple, okay? And hit it before the traffic is coming. And then most of all, work with your PPC agency, right? We're doing this, some of this, obviously some of this stuff in the background, but we wanna hear your feedback, we wanna hear your goals. And then our goals are aligned, so when we communicate and work together, these are the sorts of results that we can see.